Hello, dear friends. Let's talk about problems of Peugeot 607. Despite uh, the declining popularity of large mass products and produced exclusive cars in the 607s, Peugeot launched the 2000 in the late 2006. With a style reminiscent of the 6, a wide and spacious interior, this model has a lot to offer. However, in the segment where the car's appearance is very important, Peugeot has failed despite the new V607 engine, uh, electrically controlled suspension and built-in phone as standard. The Peugeot XNAM X received 4 stars in the Euro NCAP test and is a very safe car. When buying a Peugeot 607, you should pay attention to the electricity, the problems are not unknown. Check the cabin gadgets. Pump and clutch for diesel HDI engines, all-wheel drive. Models after September 2003 have built-in Bluetooth for wireless calling. Passengers have plenty of room in the 607, while luxury lizard flat seats add to the ride. The cheaper models are more comfortable than the more powerful V6 due to its hard suspension and large wheels. The V6 engine produces a nice sound but requires the acceleration pedal to be depressed. 2.0 and 2.0 HDI, the aggregates are good, while the 2.2 gasoline is not much more economical than the V6. The Peugeot 607 has sold in small quantities since it was launched. Despite being a good car with a lot of equipment, buyers have continued to resist non-prestigious mass-produced high-end cars, preferring to use the BMW 7 and Mercedes S-Classes. As with other large cars, diesels are more often bought than gasoline. Peugeot's uh, HDI engines have proven themselves in practice and respond nicely to the accelerator pedal. In terms of performance, interior space, driving behavior and build quality, Peugeot the 607 has achieved quite a bit with its prestigious sedan. Due to the price, these cars are a good choice for buyers who are not ready to pay for the more expensive and popular BMW 7 series and Mercedes S class. Advantages Peugeot 607 Excellent diesel, 2.2 HDI Convenient, good equi equipment, big luggage area, quality of workmanship, sound isolation Main Peugeot 607 Electronic, not a luxury name, like the rest of the competition Problems with the front axle until 2002 Oil loss, front axle problems Bad radio design, low supply engines in basic packages, weak brakes. Don't forget to subscribe my channel and if you are the owner of this car, then share your experience. It will help others to choose a car. Goodbye.